The Lynn and Lewis Wolfson II Florida Moving Image Archives contains thousands of pages of scripts of newscasts from Miami television stations WTVJ and WPLG. These scripts, organized by date starting in the early 1950s and continuing into the early 1990s, provide additional context and details to a lot of the news footage contained in both collections, and they allow us to see what the top stories were and how they fit together within the newscasts that aired on a specific date. Good afternoon from the Channel 4 Newsroom. Former State Insurance Commissioner Tom O'Malley has been sentenced to three years in federal prison for mail fraud and extortion. Details at 6 on the Ralph Rennick Report. The scripts can be matched up to their corresponding segments that are on film or videotape, allowing us to recreate the news covered on a particular day using the raw footage, some complete packages containing reporter stand-ups and live shots, and maybe a few snippets of the anchor's introductions, if they were recorded. This newest mystery child is so young and perhaps so traumatized by this situation that he refuses to talk to us or anyone else except to say mama and a few other words to his guardian. INS officials are now looking for the man who brought the child in, then disappeared after giving three false addresses. In Little Havana, Vicki Frazier, Channel 10 Eyewitness News. Many of the pages of the scripts are carbon copies or NCR forms on a lightweight paper that is susceptible to damage and deterioration. These pages can include the anchor's teleprompter printouts and technical scripts containing notations relating to film or video roll-ins and other segment details necessary for each live newscast. Most of the WTVJ scripts have already been placed into proper archival folders and boxes, while work continues on the WPLG collection. Eventually, these scripts will become accessible research tools to complement our online catalog and digitize news footage. Good night, and may the good news be yours. An illegal alien flew in from New York to claim him.